guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is about how you can contour your nose with makeup so I'm going to show you all the step step by step that's a song all the step step by step <laughs> so in this video I'm going to show you how I'm going to make my nose from this to very defined snatch contour nose without further delay let's just start contouring nose <laughs> Alright guys, as you can see, I did all my face makeup just because we just want to focus on nose contouring. We don't want to spend time anywhere else. So we just gonna start contouring our nose. So why we contour our nose? To give our nose look really really sharp and pointy. Not like this that have no shape. It's not like I hate my nose. No, no, no. I love my nose. But you know, I still want to give it like that. Like that sharp, sharp look to it. Uh, you know what I mean. Alright, so today for contouring I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hill Contour Palette. You guys of course know this palette because it's out there from so so long, many many years already. So yeah, I'm going to use this color right here, this one right here. I'm going to use a brush to draw the line. You can use any kind of sharp bl blush, sharp brush. <laughs> like I'm using this brush it have like a little bit pointy here and this one just flat brush this one from Zoeva this one is their 322 brush so you can use any of this so I'm going to use actually this one that one from Zoeva so I'm going to take this color I'm just going to take in my brush just like this so you want to draw the line, you want to start from here, from just exactly where your eyebrow finish, here. From here, straight there. So from here, straight should be, this is how should be your line. Now you can make your line so close to each other, like really, really tiny like here, or you can make it more wider. It depends how you want your nose to look. If you want your nose to look really sharp and really tiny then you want to keep the line really really close to each other you don't want to keep a lot of gap this is what normally you should do but if you really don't want anyone your nose to look more white then you can do that but main point for us to make our nose look more tiny and uh, sharp so I'm just focusing here from here and drawing a straight line till here you can see now I'm going to take the color again and then I'm doing the same thing to the other side and that's it all right that's it so you guys can already see that my nose looking really really tall now i want to make it a little bit shorter so i want to cut it right in this place just right here now you can see that it make my nose look re already short a little bit not that tall you can see that so this is exactly what you want to do so that's pretty it guys so now I'm just going to blend it so you can use your finger or you can use brush or you can use a beauty sponge but for me first I'm going to take a brush when you are blending you want to make sure that you are not blending in the middle you want to just blend in this side so this side and this side so you need to be careful on that and then just start blending so you can see that I'm taking it downward just like this this is exactly what you want to do and then just blend everything I know that I'm gonna look crazy now but when you are in the process of something it's never pretty you need to wait till the final result come out so be patient and then just stay with me so you can see that I'm blending it down I'm not going in the middle at all so I'm just focusing it downward now I'm going to move to a beauty sponge I'm going to take a beauty sponge and then just blend everything a little more Now 
you don't want to over blend it as well like you don't want to make it look really really not natural you want to keep the natural but you want to see the shape so you don't want to over blend it you just want to blend the much it need to make it look natural all right guys so it's all blended you can see that it's still noticeable but in a very subtle way so that's all you want now i'm actually going to take a powder and i'm going to take my beauty sponge and take some powder in my sponge and then I'm just going to focus in the center like the breeze of my nose and then just put the powder just like this and I'm going to set it for a while and I'm going to do the same thing from two sides of my nose so I'm just going to take some powder in my beauty sponge and then I'm just gonna bake it from this side just a little bit and the same thing I'm going to do from my opposite side so I'm going to just make a line and then just do all right so that's it I'm going to give it a little bit time until it's set and then I'll brush it off with the brush all right so it's all set so now I'm just going to brush off the powder from the middle and also from the side Okay, right, guys so now it's completely perfect now the last step is highlight so you want to grab a highlight and what you're gonna do is you want to take a small brush and where is my brush okay so you're gonna take a small brush check your highlight and you want to focus in this place and the bridge of your nose and you wanna highlight that place so just like this you don't wanna come all the way to the point of your nose you wanna leave a little bit gap here why I'm gonna tell you now and then you are going to take either your this pinky finger or a really really precise pencil brush and you want to take your highlight and the brush and then you want to just focus in here and then just put a little bit highlight so I'm giving a gap here I'm leaving a gap here between this and here so this is gonna give you that pointy looking nose that you see in Instagram and YouTube you know people have pointy nose so this is how you give it so you just gonna point and then I'm just gonna a little bit like kind of like blend it a little bit all right so that's pretty it guys all right guys so here is my complete nose contour you guys can see the different if you remember or if you don't remember then you can go back and you can see the nose without contour and you can see now there is huge different and it's looking really really more sharp and nice so yeah it's not hard it's easy but it just give your whole look a really really nice finish to it so if you guys like this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you guys are not a part of my family my youtube family then don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell so anytime i post a new video you got a notification. I think that's all for this video, guys. Thanks for joining me today. And I'll see you guys in my next upcoming video. Until then, bye-bye and take care.